U.S. Energy Information Administration reported on June 15, 2020, that global electricity consumption continues to rise faster than populations. When the coronavirus pandemic erupted worldwide, billions of people were forced to stay indoors for a long period of time. Many were dependent on what little energy they had amounted to survive. However, inasmuch as those who knew their limitations, many succumbed to greed and ignorance, just like me. And what I don't know are as much as the causes I had to pay. Electricity is one aspect we can bring to manage and conserve. But how? Why do we need to address this problem? We need to pay attention and conserve energy because it has a big effects not only on us but on our environment. Due to the increasing demand of energy with only limited supplies, result in higher energy costs also overusing and wasting of energy as well increases the cost of living. In addition, energy conservation produces higher quality of life. Reducing the use of energy also reduces carbon emission. Carbon emission plays a significant role in the global warming and climate change. Environment aside, we must conserve energy because it has only a limited source and someday it will expire. So, before we run out of energy, we must conserve and save it. Plan your day ahead of time, so as to save electricity when using the laptops and phones when doing online classes. It eliminates the time that is spent figuring out what task or requirement to do first in front of a laptop. Make sure to unplug all devices, chargers, study lamps, fans, etc. when not in use. As much as possible, Try to study during the day and to study in an area wherein the sunlight provides most of the light, which is natural lighting, so as to conserve electricity by using the LED bulb sparingly. If the temperature during a particular day is not that high, open the window so that air can come in, instead of using an electric fan or an air conditioner to keep cool. Keep your electronics free from harm by tracking them when you are charging. Unplug the gadgets as soon as they hit maximum battery life and never leave the charging unit behind. Keep the devices free from disruption and battery depletion by shutting them down. Most the laptops and computers. If you don't use the unit and instead of putting it to sleep, shut it down so that you can conserve the most energy from it. Power surges will kill a device, cost money, and cost unsaved data or data that has not been backed up in the cloud to be lost. Many people are replacing their old incandescent, halogen and compact fluorescent lamps with light emitting diet lamps. There are many advantages including improved energy efficiency, lower power expenses, longer filament life, and a healthier and cleaner light source overall. We have seen enough results. We have been given the advice. Possible consequences are laid in front of our eyes. The choice is in your hands. The future is in our keeping. What your decisions today defines the way the future will live. Be wise. Conserve energy.